then the mountains tremble and the seas rumble in the southeastern fringes of Ghana. If you give a duck a chance, it will prefer to fly like a kite, while if you uncover secrets of life, For that, I hear the wretched stories of wars every day from sun up to sundown turn me into a gorilla. And this poem is called The Olympians poised to overcome even when weak, alert to tick even against countrymen and yester athletes now famous from yester races, poised to bring home medals and to mount the prestigious platforms with colorful flags swaying above and national anthems trailing along. Yet in their different ambitions they still form a nation spurred by the spirit of sports to earn a few dollars for fame and the gifts of nature, the gifts that nature has endowed in them as pendants. Their muzzle tones and agile hearts will keep them moving and all going long after they have undressed as Olympians and to nature calls across the globe must have resided. Well, this poem is simply talking about the spirit of sportsmen and women, uh, Olympians, their zeal to win races. The, though they compete with each other, sometimes you also feel that they belong to the same nation. Competition is part of their lives, and they understand that that is what is going to make them to mount the colorful platforms trailing with national anthems. And so sometimes in their differences, in their competitive spirits you can see that they are birds of the same feathers and they are flocking together and then we say they are driven not only by the spirit of sports they are driven by the intention to exploit the gift that has been given to them and also to make use of their physical fitness and the poem ends by suggesting that long after they must have been out of sports. Their muscular tones and their agile hearts will keep them um, agile and healthy for a long period of time. So the poem is also a poem of praise for athletes and it is suggesting that sports is healthy and people who take on to sports are able to live more healthy lives when they are old. Then the mountains tremble and the seas rumble in the southeastern fringes of Ghana. If you give a duck a chance, it will prefer to fly like a kite, while if you uncover secrets of life.
For that, I hear the wretched stories of wars. Every day from sunup to sundown, turn me into a gorilla.